So if you have your book, you can open it with me. And you can go with me also. I I'm actually kidding, you know. You're a teacher. Thank you for supporting me. Thank you for being with me. Being with our class for today for one hour. So, this is a quite long, you know. One hour is quite long, but I try to ask you something also. So I am very, very happy and glad that once last one day have the mother. Their mother is teacher Lalita, teacher Mapra. So once less two, they have also their mother. The mother is teacher Sai. And also we have once less three. Teacher Jia, of course. Of course, teacher Jia. My long time partner. <laughs> My long time partner. So we're a partner for many years. I think for five years, right? Four years, uh, five years, yeah. Five years. All right, so get your book. Today. So we will be following this book as we go on with our topic. Pages, I will I will tell you. Animals 20, 20, 20. All right, so here we will be starting on pages 25. Yes, 25, 26. And also 27 and 28. Yeah. There are four pages that we are going to talk about for today. From 25 to 28. Then the 20, 29 later. Are you ready? Show me like this if you're ready. Put the one, are you ready? <laughs> the one is so cute. This girl is so cute, you know. I, you're so cute, girl. Yeah. Oh, wow. Prepare your worksheet as well. Oh, good, good. Right. So let's start. So, what can you see in the picture? What can you see in the picture? Pictures, pictures of an animals, right? Or so we say pictures of animals, different kinds of animals. We have bird. We have what is this? We have ducks. Is it, is it a duck? Swan. Yeah, we have the swan here. We have cat or kitten. We have the rooster. We have fish. We have bad fly. Of course, we have dog. So as you can see, I am viewing to you different types of animals. Animals that help us in our daily activities or animals that will not help us or animals that we eat every single time or animals that we, we, we did not eat. So different types of animals that I'm showing to you today. Yeah, on page 25. So the title of our topic for Today is how do we group animals? So how do we group animals? Do you have any idea, kids? How do we group animals? Okay, in grouping animals, there are many, many ways. Like we can group animals based on the, the wings. We can group animals based on their legs as well. We can group animals based on their characteristics. We can group animals based on the places that they live, anything and so on and so forth. And today we are going to talk about how are we going to group animals based on their characteristics. Okay, now here, grouping animals. The first one that we are going to, that I'm going to tell you is animals with similar characteristics are grouped together. So as what I have told you, we will be talking about characteristics of animals. Characteristics of 
animals. If you want to interrupt, if you want to speak, raise your hand and I will let you speak. That's the thing. That's the deal. Okay, if you want to speak, just click the reactions button down there. Raise your hand and I will recognize you. I will ask you to unmute your, your, your phone and then you can speak. All right, so we have here. All right, so let's continue. She's just trying. So look at these animals. I will show you later on. What characteristics do, do they share? So some animals are sharing the, the same. What do you mean by the same? The same characteristics. Similar means the same. Okay, similar means the same. The same. If you will say not the same, that means not, not similar. Okay, let's look at some attributes or characteristics of these animals later on. Each animal has beak, has a beak, two legs, two wings, and body covered with feathers or feathers. How do you call these animals? Who can answer? Who can recognize this one? If you can see animals, raise your hand, please. If you can see these animals, yes, we have Tonam. Yes, Tonam. It is a bird. It is a bird. Let's see if your answer is correct. Yes, Monich is also raising her hand, but you're late. And also we have Puna. Yeah, something like that. The girl is unmuted already. So Monich is raising, but you just lead for a, while, for a second. Right, so we have Tonam. Tonam said it's a bird. Let's see if your answer is correct. So by reading this one, this animal has beak. You know what is beak like that? Hi, baby. Daughter, yeah, the sister of Monich. Two legs we have here and also two wings and feathers. So as you can see, these animals are what? According to Tanam, let's see. Tanam says, this group of animals are called... Are you ready? <laughs> are you ready? So this animal are called birds, yes. These animals are called birds. Birds, right? Do not say that only birds. According here, listen carefully, according here has a beak. If you will say has a beak, that means only one beak. Beak has two legs, two wings, and have feathers, covered with feathers. These animals are called birds. So I will give you an example of a bird, or I will be asking you, give me one example of a bird. Okay, Monich, I will recognize you because you're raising your hand until this time. Give me an example of a bird. Pigeon. Pigeon, yes. Thank you. Thank you, Munit. That's an example of a bird. Yes, we have tin. Parrot. Parrot. Parrot is an example also of a bird. Wow, what well, you know? Because I know that you're good. So let's see. Okay. Parrot, right? Some of you says parrot. And yes, we have Namning. Namning, yes. Give me one example of a bird. Hello, teacher. Hi, hi. Give me one example of a bird. Okay, give me one example of a bird. Eagle. Eagle. Eagle, Eagle. E Eagle is a bird. Thank you, Namnin. Okay, I will do like that. All right, we have Milin. Yes. Give me an example of a bird.
Yes, girl. I, I can't hear you. Yes, yes, girl. Yeah, just raise your hand. I will just call you later. Flamingo. Flamingo, yes, thank you. Flamingo is one of the examples of a bird. Okay, um, mute your microphone. You have Ellen, yes? Ellen. King Fisher. Thank you, King Fisher. We have here. Thank you. Every time. Yes, yes, we have also here. Yes, the num, the num, yeah. Penguin. Penguin is a bird. Yes, we have here. Panachanon, yes, Panachakuan, yeah. Ice. Huh? Ice. I ice? What uh, is that a bird? Yeah, yeah, bird, bird. I'm 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 actually asking for a bird. All right, all right. Thank you. Just mute your microphone, please. Alex. Ostrich. Ostrich. Thank you. Ostrich is a bird too. Thank you. We have yes, one each. An owl. Owl. Yes, owl is a bird. If you do not say it again, if your friends already said, already say it, so do not say it again. All right. So we have it here. Train. Train. Yeah? Jenna? Jenna. All right, ZK. Thank you. Thank you. We have here Maya. Yes, Maya. Kiwi. Kiwi. Bird Kiwi. Bird Kiwi. Okay, thank you. Thank you. All right, I, I, I'm, I've never seen Kiwi also in my life, but I want to see that one. All right, Stan? Canaries. What is that, please? Canary. Oh, thank you. I, I don't know that bird, but I know that you know. <laughs> Can you say show it to me that word? I don't know that bird actually. Opal. Yes. <laughs> don't love it, please, Dan. Huh? What is that? Dragonfly. Dragonfly. Yes. Oh, thank you. Thank you for your answer. Okay, dragonfly. Remember that word, huh? Remember that word. <laughs> dragonfly. You said dragonfly. Oh, Munich. Why you raise your hand again? You want to answer? Yes? Ah, oh, you want to answer again. Okay, okay, okay. I think this last two, last three. Hummingbird. Hummingbird, yes. Hummingbird is an example as well. Ryu, we have Alex and then 10. Uh Firefly. Firefly? Butterfly? Yeah. Up, oh, firefly. Okay, remember the word? Firefly as we go on with our topic. Now, I think last we have Opal. Tanam is finished. We have this tin. A uh, tin, tin. Yes, tin. Swan. Peacock. Peacock. Peacock is correct. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Peacock is a bird. We have here Kod Chapon. Yes. Kod Chapon. Parrot. Parrot. I, I think parrot is already done, but it's okay. I'll accept that. Okay. Thank you. All right. So I will tell you some of you answered like dragonfly, some of you answered um, but butterfly, something like that. All right. So let's see if your answers are correct later on. So remember this one. I told you, right? Remember, a bird has beak, has a beak, two legs, two wings, and have covered with feathers. Okay, remember, you said the birds are ready. And I will tell you more. I will tell you more about the birds. All right. So I, I observed that no one... Tell about these animals. I will show you cards, of course. Okay, what is the definition of a bird? A bird has one beak covered with feathers, two legs, and two wings. Remember, birds have a beak, 
has has a beak covered with field feathers, two legs, and two wings. Remember on that, kids. Okay, we have here a beak, wings, of course, a leg, and a body covered with feathers. So as you can see, these are the parts of a bird. The bird has beak, has a beak, and you will not call it mouth. It called beak. Okay, remember, the bird has a beak and dog has a mouth. Remember, I have a mouth, you have a mouth, but a bird has a beak. That's different. Okay, we have Kingfisher. Some of you says Kingfisher, and your answer is correct for that. We have Egret. I never seen this one. I think I, I saw this animal already. Egret, usually they live in a grassland. Uh, I am not really sure. I'm not really sure about it. If you know, then tell me. Where does Egret live? If you know, then raise your hand. Because I'm not really sure if the Egret is living in the grassland. I'm not pretty sure about it. All right, so we have owl. Owl is an example of a bird as well because it has beak. It has beak and has two wings and has two legs, of course, and covered with feathers. <gasps> Duck? Duck is a bird? Who will say, teacher, I think you are wrong. I want to say something that duck is a bird. Maybe some of you will say, oh, I'm sure you are wrong. Because a duck is not a bird. A duck is a duck. It's not a bird. Who will say? Who will say, sure, a duck is not a bird? Who will say that? No one? Remember? What is the definition of a bird? What is its character? Yes, Alex. Alex. Alex wants to say. Yes, Alex. I think Alex wants to say something about it. Want to comment? Maybe we'll, you will say that it's her, it's not a bird, it's a duck. It's sir, it's a bird, it's not a duck, you're wrong. We'll say that. Who among you against with me? All right, so we have Tin. Yes, Tin. It's a duck. It's a duck. It's not a bird, right? Yes. So it's not a bird. It's not a bird, right? Yes. Oh, I will ask you. Does, does a duck has a beak? Yes or no? Yes. 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 <laughs> does a duck has two legs? Yes. Oh, yes, yes, again, okay. Does a duck has two wings? Yes. Oh, yes, again, has beak, has a beak, two wings, a two wings, yeah? And has two legs. Has a duck covered what with- What did ask you? <laughs> covered with feathers, yes or no? Yes. Yes, so that means the bird. <laughs> duck is a bird. Thank you, Tin. Thank you. Thank you for asking. You're so cute, then. So that means a duck is what belongs to a group. This one is a group. Group of birds. Okay? Because birds is very wide. This is very broad or general. If you will say birds, you can say, yeah, a duck is one of the groups of a bird but that duck has a uh, his his its own name okay yes maya okay remember a duck is a bird as well group of a bird all right so you can say duck is a bird a group of a bird yes maya yes maya maya the bee Yes, Maya wants to say something. No? No? All right, so I, I think, I think no. All right, so let's proceed. So remember, a duck is 
we can consider it a bird. <laughs> Remember, kids? Yes, penguin. Penguin has a beak. Penguin has two wings. And of course, penguin has two legs and covered with feathers. So that means penguin is belong to the group of birds. Okay? The group, group. Group of birds. We have ostrich. Yeah, we know already ostrich is also belongs to bird to a bird. The group of birds. So another thing here. All right, who can give another example? Aside from it, aside from those animals that you mentioned. Okay, what about? Chicken, who can say something? Who will say that? A chicken is not a bird, teacher. A chicken is a chicken. A chicken is not a bird. Who will say that? Raise your hand, please. You will say, teacher, a chicken is a chicken. Not a bird. <laughs> who will say that? <laughs> okay, no one. I think. All of you will say that a chicken belongs to a group of a bird or a birds, a group of birds. Okay, chicken because the chicken has a beak like this beak, and a bird has a bird. A chicken has two wings, of course, and a covered with feathers, and of course, a chicken has two legs as well. So that is pretty, pretty true. That a chicken is belongs to a family of a uh, birds. Thank you. Okay, family of a uh, birds. Next, this animal. Yes, 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 yes. All right. Some one of some some of you are raising your hands, but do you cancel that? All right. Another thing. Each animal has six legs. Remember. Six legs, two feelers, and a body made up of three parts. What do you think is this animal? Raise your hand. These animals have six legs. Remember, have you seen an animal that has six legs and two feelers? Two feelers and three. Body parts, yes. Milin, Milin, Milin is raising her, her hand. Yes, Milin. Bees. 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 Thank you, thank you. Bees is an example. Thank you. But my question is that what group of animal is this? Group of animals. Like, for example, the first thing that we talk about is group of a bird, group of birds, so we'll say like that. Now, this one, what group of animals? I think the first person, the first student raised his hand. Yeah, we have here Munitz, Munitz. Yes, Munitz is the first one there. Up, let's see. Let's see if you know. And. And. Insects. 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 Let's see if you're correct. Let's see. Okay, thank you. Raise your hands, uh, down your hands already. Thank you. So we have here, according to Munich, this group of animals are called bow. <laughs> the mother of Munich, go away. So an insect. Okay, and insects are actually has what? Two feelers like that and three body parts. One, two, three. There are three body parts. What about, um, what else? Two feelers, six legs. Yeah, there are six legs. As you can see that, this type of animal has six legs. Oh, come on. <laughs> what kind of animal is this? 
if you can say this animal has six legs, oh no. All right, so who can give an example? Raise your hand, please, of an insect. Because a while ago, I saw it that some of you, some of the students actually, some of you answered a bee, some of you answered a dragonfly, something like that. So we have, we have, yes, the first person here that raised her, his hand is Ellen. Yes, Ellen, give me an example of what? An animal that, animal that, an example of an insect. Yes, Ellen. Dragonfly. Dragonfly. I think your answer is correct. So dragonfly is one of that example. Okay, lower your hand, please. And, and I, I will be done to lower your hand. All right, so the next person here, or the next student that raised her hand is we have Namning. Yes, Namning. I will just follow. I will just follow the... Oh. Yes. Oh. Mm. B, okay. B is an example of insect. Let's see. And thank you. Your answer is correct. We have Stang. Yes, Stang. Grasshopper. Grasshopper. I think you glimpsed my, my power pen. All right, it's okay. <laughs> your answer is correct, Stang. Yeah, you're doing like this, huh? All right, so we have Tin. Yes, Tin. What is your answer? Fly and ladybug. <laughs> Only one. Only your, one. Your friends cannot answer. What is the what is your answer? What is your answer? Only one. Only one. What's your answer? Ladybug. Ladybug. Okay. We because we will give chance to your friends. Okay, ladybug is correct. Your answer is correct. Then. All right, so next we have Tonam. Yes. Grass. Oh, grasshopper finished. <laughs> but it's okay. It's okay. Grass huh? Mosquito. Mosquito. Okay, mosquito. Thank you. If it is already finished, do not say it again, okay? Oh, Monich. Monich raising her, her hand again. Very active. Mosquito. What? Beetle. Beetle. Yes, beetle is an example of insect. Let's see. I'm <laughs> so proud of you, Kate. We have Alex. Fly. Fly. Thank you, Alex. Fly. Next, we have. Oh, where's the one that. Oh, okay, we have the, the. Oh, the, where are you, the? The, 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 the. the. Yes, D. Yes, yes, yes. D, what is your answer, D? Bees. Bees or bees, right? It's already finished, but it's okay. All right, so no one is raising their hands now. Let's see. Okay, remember? Remember the definition? <laughs> Tapondong, you want to answer? Nari, Nari Sara, yes, Nari Sara. Because you're raising your hand, so I will recognize. This is the last, now. Nah? This is the last. All right. So, what is your answer, girl? Huh? Beetle. Beetle. Be beetle. Yeah. Beetle is finished. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. So we have punawit. Let's see. I think this is the last, now. Nah? Let's proceed. Punawit. What is your answer, boy? Boy. Panuit, yes, panuit, yeah, not panuit, panuit. Yeah, what's your answer? No, you don't know, you forgot. I, I, I cannot hear you. All right, all right, let's proceed, let's proceed. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 
All right. So another thing, example we have here in the insect is grasshopper. So grasshopper belongs to insects. We have because a grasshopper has six legs and the body has, you know, divided into three parts. Okay. 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 So insects is like that. We have the head and this is the, the shoulder, the, the shoulder part and the body divided into three. We have here the ants. Remember the ant is an example of insect. We have the head and the second, this one divided into three. As you can see, look at this one. The ant has like that. This is one. And the second one is two and three. So you can say that this animal is an insect because their body is divided into three, three parts. And then they have six legs. Remember, okay, six legs. And they have two feelers, like this, two feelers. Okay, that, that's called feeler. Okay, we have ant. Of course, we have bee. The bee is an insect as well. We have beetle. Beetle is an insect. And we have also fly. Fly is an insect as well. And we have mosquito. Yes. Your friend says mosquito. Mosquito is, is an insect. So as what I have told you, these are the definition of it. Then you can recognize that this animal is an insect because of this, um, because of its characteristics. We have feelers, two feelers, three body parts, one, two, three. And of course we have six legs. This animal has six legs, remember? And that animal is called or belongs to insects, okay? We have number one, we have birds. Number two, we have insects. Another thing, another one. Each animal has a fins, remember? A tail and a body covered with scales. Who can say that this animal is a group of... Oh, okay, Monich is raising her hand very fast. Can I, I recognize you, Fish. girl? Fish. Thank you. I think the answer is correct because the, the characteristics of these animals inherit the, the fins. We have the tail and a body covered with scales. Remember, have fins, okay? Have fins, have tail, and have, of course, have um, scales. Okay. Group of animals. Okay, we have who can give an example? Actually, I have few um few knowledge when it comes to fish. L Alex. It's a barb. Barb, barb fish. Barb fish, right? I, I actually I have few knowledge of a bird. You can few knowledge, yeah. I have a knowledge, but very few. Right, so I think you're correct for that. If that's a fish, then it's okay. Yes, Ellen. Ellen, where's Ellen? I will call Ellen, but Ellen is. I forgot. I'm sorry, Ellen. So we have Chayapon, yeah, Chayapon. <laughs> Give me an example of a fish. Yeah. yeah. Alan, you can raise your hand again. Chayapon, yes. Give me one example of a, a fish. It should be in English because I, I, I don't know in Thai. But if you can, you can speak, it's okay. It's okay as well. All right, thank you, thank you. I'll give a chance to others. 
All right, so we have, um, I will give chance to others. Narisa, yes, Narisa. Shark. Shark, let's see if shark is correct. Okay, thank you. You said shark. Okay, thank you. We have, yeah, Alan. I actually click Alan, but. Whale. Whale. Some says shark, some says whale. Thank you, Alan. Let's see if your answers are correct later on. So we have here to Nam, yeah. Walrus. What is that? Walrus. Uh, again, please. Seal. Seal. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I, I'm not, uh, I did not hear it clearly, but I know that you say something. All right, so we have here, Stan. Clownfish. Clownfish. Okay, okay, clownfish. All right, thank you. Oh, Monich is here again. And so, of course, I will give you a chance, Monich. So before Monich, we have Maya. Yeah, Maya. Goldfish. Goldfish. Uh, thank you. Goldfish. I think Tunam says goldfish. <laughs> I'm not really sure about it. Maybe I did not hear it clearly. Right, Monich? The next is Namning. Catfish. Yes. What? Catfish. Catfish. Thank you. All right. So we have Namning. Yes, Namning. And then Alex. Goldfish. Okay, thank you. You said goldfish like that. I, I know that you have um, knowledge when it comes to... We have Ellen. Yeah, Ellen. Eel. Eel. Thank you. Eel. Okay. All right, we have uh, Tin, then Milin. Tin first, then Milin. Tin first. Crab. Crab? <laughs> I know. Crab, crab, oh, um, okay, thank you, thank you. <laughs> crab, do you think crab is a fish? He might be confused. Uh, okay, <laughs> it's okay, Tin, it's okay. It's okay, because you answered as well, so it's okay. Crab, let's see if crab is a fish, okay? Okay, okay. All right, thank you, Tin. All right, so we have here, Milin, yes, Milin. Salmon. Salmon. Thank you. Thank you so much. We have here a pinya, yes. Shark. Shark. Some of, many of you are today. Two of you is shark already. We have the the yes, the okay. what is that again, please? Oh. Fish. Fish. Yeah, fish. Starfish. Star, starfish. Starfish. Okay, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Starfish. Okay, let me see your friends here. Maybe some of you are raising their hands. Yes, should jump one. Oh, pilot. Pilot. Pilot, I cannot recognize you because you're not clicking the reactions. You can. You can tona. Click. Yeah. Tona, tona, tona. Yes. Tona, Tona. Thank you. Tona. Tona is great. Where are you? Unmute your microphone, please. Yeah, yeah. Uh, pilot, pilot, where are you, pilot? Yeah, that's why I, I cannot recognize you because you did not click the reaction buttons. Yeah, Sunny, 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 Sainta also. Sainta, right? Sainta. All right, so Sainta. Also here, Sainta, right? But I will ask pilot, pilot first, where are you? Click. Can you click the reaction button so that your name will appear? Yeah, if you click the reactions button, yeah. Yeah, pilot, pilot is here. Yes, pilot wants to say something. Hello. Uh, snake head. Okay, thank you. Pilot, pilot, yes, pilot. Hello. You, you can click the reactions button, the button there. Click the reaction and there's um, 
a button there that raise your hand. You can raise your hand so that your name will appear. Because I cannot, I cannot recognize you. You're raising your hand. So another one here, another student actually raising his hand. Yeah, it's hard for me to, you know, I, we have here Sainta, right? See, you will click the reactions button there, down there, down there. Yeah, you can click there and then I will I can recognize you easily. Very easy. Like them, like them. They're raising their hands so I can recognize them. Where are you? Where are you? And Fentor also here. So yeah, I cannot see you. Yes, yeah, Sainta, yes, yeah, Sainta. Oh, okay. Yes. Beta. Beta. I don't know that fish, but I know that you know. <laughs> yeah, I don't have any like, more knowledge on a fish, but I know that your answer is correct. Maybe. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Sainta. You click the reaction button. Yeah, so that your name will be easy to pop up. Your name will pop up. Okay, thank you. Now let's proceed to this one. Clownfish. You know what is clownfish? Yes, is an example of a fish as well. Of course, because the, from the name clownfish, of course, this is an example of a fish. The next one, we have a goldfish. Goldfish has what? Has scales, fins, and tail. We have a barb. Mm, some of you maybe see barb fish. Yeah, I have also like scales, fin, and tail. Shark, some of you says shark, and your answer is correct. Yes, shark is a fish, belongs to fish. Thank you for that. And then we have here, body covered with scales and fin. We have fin and have fins there, two fins and a tails as well. All right, so that's the definition of a fish. All right, so another thing that you have to remember last, because you are in Platum 1. Actually, grouping of animals, there are many. We have amphibians, we have reptiles, and so on. But in your book, I will just follow because you are still in Platum 1. You're still in grade 1. I will just follow the four things. We have fish, insects, and number three, we have and uh, number four, we have fish. And number four, each animal has a body covered with hair or fur. Okay, hair or fur. And make milk to feed young. So as you can see here, these animals have milk. Usually, these animals have milk. And the first one who raised her hand, I think, Narisa. Narisira. Yes, what is this animal? What group of animal is this? Cow. Mm, okay, thank you. Cow is an example of this group of animal. Thank you. But my question is, what group of animal is this? We have Stang. Oh, sorry. Where's this? Where's Stang? All right, so we have here. Yes, yeah, Stang, Stang. What group of animal is this thing? Yeah, sorry. Okay, again. Buffalo. Okay, buffalo is one of the examples, but my question is, what group of animal is this we have here? Uh, Munich? Mammals. Mammals. These animals are called mammals. Thank you. See, easy for me to recognize because you click the reaction buttons. If you keep click the reaction buttons, your your face will pop up now in the first the first um section. So this animal called mammals. <laughs> mammals. Okay. mammals. These animals have milk usually, and this animal has, of course covered with fur or hair like that. And of course, this animal, what is the definition again? 
covered in fur and the body covered with fur and also the feet. Okay. So example, we have elephant. Elephant, yes, elephant feed their young with milk. And I will not ask you now because we don't have time. We have the mouse. Mouse is also an example of a mammal. Kangaroo is also a mammal. Leopard is also a mammal. Whale is a mammal. Some of you, the whale is belong, is belong to fish, but it's not. Whale is belong to mammal. Okay, kids? Only shark. Shark belongs to fish, but but whales belong to mammal. We have seal. So here we have the hair or fur. Also the, the person, me and you, belongs to mammals. All right, so let's try this one by answering. So, okay, we don't have time. We will go directly to... I will, I will answer this one only, then we will go directly to the quiz. Okay, we have here, dog is a mammal. Ladybug is an insect, remember? Lion is a mammal. Bee is an insect. Cat is a mammal. Fish. Chicken is a bird. Fish. Goose or this is goose, right? Goose is a bird, belongs to bird. Now let's this time is a short quiz. Let's see if we can finish this one. All you have to do, just answer if it is a bird, mammal, insect, or uh what is that? Insect fish. Okay, just answer like that. Right. I want you to lower your hands to give chance to others. All right, so let's see. All you have to do is just answer. Ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. All right, so ready, go. What is egret? Belongs to mammal, insect, bird, or fish? Raise your hand, please. All right. All right, so we have Munich, the first one. Munich, what's your answer? Bird. What? Bird. Bird. Your answer is Five, see. four, three, two, one. Your answer is correct. Yeah! Thank you. Okay, this time, those who already answered, I will not call you. Okay, I will give chance to others. I will give chance to others. All right, so if I can see you that you already answered, okay, I will not call you. Okay, give them to other. Okay, because oh, your friends did not answer. Five, four, oh. three, two, one. All right, so number two, we have here. I will choose if it is mammal, insect, fish, or bird. I will choose mm, your friends who did not answer. My finished. Nurse finished. Right, so we have Captain. Yes, Captain. This is the first first time that Captain. I call you. Yes. What is that? Belongs to? Penguin. Mammal. You have to choose mammal, insect, bird, bird or fish. No. Fish. Yes. Bird. Okay, your answer is bird. That's it. Mammal. All right. So you said penguin belongs to bird. That's it. Yes. I will give chance to I will give chance to others. All right, so let's see. Raise your hand now. I will call you. To those who did not answer yet, I give you a chance. Okay, who can answer? Mammal, insect, fish, or bird? Raise your hand, please. I will call you. Uh, I know. Stang finished. Tonam finished. Namling finished. Narisa finished. Ellen finished. Maya finished. So we will give chance to others. Captain is also finished. So we'll give 
Oh yeah, we have Puntawan. Yes, Puntawan. I know it's an insect. Insect? Let's see. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Your answer is. <laughs> Good. Next, number three. I will give chance to others as well. Raise your hand, please. I will call you. Yes, guy. 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 Yes. What is your answer, guy? Mammal, insect, fish, or bird? Insect. Five, Let's see. four, three, two, one. we have here raise your hand only i think alex is finished so Santa is finished i will not go to those oh yes we have here tana okay tan chanok tan chanok yes tan chanok what's your answer what's your answer please tan chanok speak now Hello? I can't I can hear you. You're still on mute. Can you mute it? Yeah, click it, click. Fish. Yes. What is that? Fish. Fish. Let's see if your answer is correct. Five, four, three, two, one. Very good. Your answer is correct. <laughs> I'm sorry, I will not call you, okay? Okay, I will not call you. I will give chance to others as well. Okay, you have here shark. Oh, I think, I think, I think I'm wrong with this. Where's the shark? Shark is not a mammal. Shark is a fish. I, I forgot, I forgot. Okay, I answered it already. <laughs> I answered it already, so I will not ask you the shark. Let's proceed to number seven. Okay, number seven. Who wants to answer? I will be calling again here. Santa is there, but I think Santa is already done. And yeah, Tonam is already finished. So I will not call Tonam. Mailin is already finished as well. But I think Sainta is answered only one, you know. Sainta, where are you, please? I want to see you. Yeah, Sainta, what is your answer? Mammal, insect, or a fish or bird? Mammal. Let's see. Five. Oh, sorry. Four, three, oh. two, oh, no. one. Oh, no, oh, no. Okay, number seven, number eight, number eight, yeah. Those who answered already, I will not call you. <laughs> because we will give chance to other, to other friends, to your friends. All right, so I think no one there. Let's go back. Yes, this, boom. Oh, I think you're not. Raise your hand, please. I will, I, will, I will try to look at you. Right, so. Hey, Saint Tavinis, I will not call you. <laughs> you're done, Saint Ta. Yeah. Saint is already done. Mama. Hey, Saint, can you please close your microphone? Mute your microphone, please. Saint, thank you, Saint. All right, so I think. Hmm. Yes, Panachak Panachakwan. I will call this girl because she's. Mama. Mammal, let's Five, see. Five, four, three, two, one. And your answer is... <laughs> okay, no one is there now. I think... Trin, yes, Trin, I called Trin only once. Okay, Trin, this is for you. Mammal, insect, fish, or bird. Insect. Oh, yes. Yeah, insect. The Five, next is shape. Next four, is shape. Three, 
two, two six. One. Yes, your answer is correct. Yeah. Next, number 10 is save. Yeah, this is for you. Save. Last mammal, insect, fish, or bird? What is your answer, go? Oh, you can't tap at this there, but let's see. If your answer is correct, then be it. Okay. Can that save? You want to answer or not? Okay, I think save doesn't like. So let's proceed to Kantapat. Kantapat, what is your answer? Mamma. Mamma, let's see. If Five, correct. four, three, two, one. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's all for today, all about the grouping of animals. And kids, always remember that every time that uh, we finish our, our topic, you have to answer the worksheet. Okay, the worksheet is entitled, how do we, um, how, how, what are the groups of animals, something like, I will I'll read it again. How do we group animals? Okay, you are going to answer the worksheet in that specifically. And in your book, of course, you are going to answer page page 29 29 and 31 in your book in your book answer page 20 pages 29 and 31 thank you so much kids for coming for today have a good day to all of you because i have my